Hey everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode on the Vapor SMP. We've been trying to get ready for the dragon fight which is going to be just in a moment. It's proven harder with all just the, the only villagers for that we have so we are going to later on in the episode have to breed up some more villagers. We've got a drop sheet so that we can take some villagers over to where we're going to be making the hall. We've also got to figure out a way to get our horse back up. She's stuck down there. I fell down the hole. <laughs> Anywho, hit that like button. Subscribe if you are, haven't already. Yeah, leave me a comment. How are you liking the Vapor SMP so far? Without, without further ado, roll the intro. So, like I said before, we are going to do the dragon today. So, we're going to go and meet up with everybody at the stronghold in a sec. We're going to go and meet up with Blossom, see when we get there. So, we are here with Blossom, and we have just been given the deets on the uh, dragon fight. We're going to be doing it with wooden knives and snowballs, people. <laughs> so, we're probably going to head to the uh, stronghold here with Blossom in a second. We're in a massive group right now. We're probably going to make our own group up or whatever. So yeah, take me to the roof. I've never been before. Where did you go? Oh, there you are. Yeah, there we go. You lost me like three times on my own <laughs> mountain. That was so funny. Yeah, I'm really good at How getting lost. How did you lost. manage to consistently miss? I know it's a hole in the wall, but it's convenient. It's actually quite close to my portal. Oh, that's good. Okay. Tada! Oh, with all the horses! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Wow! Mark, are you seeing this? This is insane! I really wish I could build like these guys because this is insane. It was actually a normal uh, portal room, but the guys on the server just decided why not. And there she is, in all their glory. She's the last thing that we need to do before we can fly around the server. Now you just saw us all jump in, but I didn't actually do very well. I didn't stick the land in, you could say. Mercy! Oh my god! Uh -oh. Oh, That's no. not good. I wasn't the only one that fell. There was a couple of us actually. But once we got back on our feet, we decided to go straight back into the battlefield where all the carnage was. I feel like we'd all taken it upon ourselves to have our own roles. Blossom brought all the food so that we could have a celebratory meal after the dragon was dead. A couple other people decided they were gonna be the ones that took care of the crystals. It's an important job, so I respect that. But it did all get a bit crazy. The Endermen were all crazed and attacking in a frenzy by the time I got back there. Luckily, there were a few people that decided they were going to put pools of water down for our safety. It didn't work as nicely as we would have liked, but it still worked. I did die, unfortunately, and it felt like we all died a bunch of times. The Endermen were just going crazy. But after a long old while, Manatee had a change of heart because the snowballs just weren't cutting it. They don't actually damage the dragon. It did take a long while to remember that, but once Manatee did, things changed. And I think we're all glad that it did because if it didn't, then... Yeah, he came out with a bow and once that first shot was fired, that dragon didn't stand a chance.
So after Blossom's luxurious feast, we made our way to the portal opened up by the dragon and we threw ourselves through, ending up right next to or on top of an end city. We then formed a group. We would actually become quite a band of misfits between each other and we made our way through intentionally to go and get our own um, elytras but it turns out that Gasp, our axolotl friend, already had an elytra so they ended up flying off and grabbing some for us whilst we just sat and built what would later become the Golden Apple Hotel and we ended up talking about the lore of our worlds so here's a couple of clips of that. I don't know if you're familiar with Iron Man 3. Yes. Oh, like this Malibu. This Malibu. Oh. Yup. That mansion is going to be my starter base. And then I'm going to attach to it. So far I have a list. It's going to be uh, a cafe and a fighting ring. Right. So very eclectic there. Very fun. Uh, and Dandolph is going to be a sky wizard. And I'm going to be angry at him because he's going to be casting me always in a shadow, ruining <laughs> my property value and keeping me in the darkness. And also, I will have a skulk vibe and theme. It's getting very he's dark. He's a real I'm villain. Is capitalist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have, I have a um, a hellish cave base at currently, and Ooh. I plan to make my mega base in the Nether. Oh, cool. yeah. sounds like I have this fun. on my back. So I am immune to lava and fire damage. Oh, yeah, nice. but he's not immune to the void, so he will most certainly have the same struggles as all of us here. Yeah. <laughs> are you are you guys like house building while I'm <laughs> We're building yeah, a house. Pretty much. We got a hot tub. Yeah, so we got the beautiful. You got a hot tub. Yeah, we got a hot tub. Yeah, we got a hot tub. We got a little yeah. sink over here. Yep. Oh gosh, I wish I wasn't the one flying around. <laughs> we got, hold on, I could, we, we got a I could be getting squid ink past. Oh, some okay. chairs. That was my... Some, ch some chairs, chair. yeah. We got a I big throne over chair. here. I, I, I live in isolation. I'm on a mountain, and that, that's about it. Is your house the spruce with the giant lush cave near it? Yes. Oh god, not the lush caves. Things. And you're just in the floor, Leo. I'm just the I chair. <laughs> I am just the chair. He's in the chair. He's the guy from he... Harry Potter and the the uh the, whatever it's called that one movie. Yeah, the chair man. Harry Potter and the one movie. I love that one. Oh, oh you know That's my favorite. Harry Potter oh and the one movie. And the one. Movie. Oh, my favorite one is the one movie part two. You guys are lucky. Actually, you didn't go to this end city. Besides the ship, there's no chess. Right, I got ahead. <laughs> Are you ahead of everyone else then? I, I'll take some curry. Yeah, I'm very, very hungry. We are at like 26, there you go. 45. It's so good, it gives you an achievement even, okay? Can you, can you type it in chat, please? Oh, I'm not even in the state. I'm like. Yeah, you're glitched through the ground and you can. You know what? Take... I live here now. This, this I'm at like. I live in the ground. 6,000. <laughs> because, uh, because of the. Uh, that. Show, um, oh, show me your armor mod. I have. Um, I have yeah. translucent um, shields. Ah. <laughs> and oh. when they're translucent, they make that part of you invisible. Cool. Yeah, me and Leaf are immediately like, yeah. You're just a floating head. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> wow. My head. Right. Oh, my head. Wow. Oh. Anyone like mushroom soup or beetroot soup? No. Nope. <laughs> That's every Minecrafter's least favorite food. Yeah, we're building a second floor. We've yeah, built we're garden chairs. We're working on the second floor of our house. Uh, we need some stairs and then we're By the time yeah, I come we're... back, it's going to be fully furnished and you're going to be selling it to someone. There you go. <laughs> now we got a stairs. Nope. See, when nope. they made the Lego movie, they were thinking about people like us. I really wish <laughs> I had a bed so I could make a joke about placing a bed here and then sleeping in it. <laughs> you know what? Every house needs a crafting table. <laughs> wait, 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 Just to really fill in the space. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Wait, is it 1,300 blocks away, guys? 
No, 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 don't, don't, don't. It would blow us all sky high. Here he comes. Oh, hey. <laughs> how how beautiful is the house? How beautiful indeed. So we spent a bit of time just messing around building this house. Uh, ended up being a hotel. We built a bar inside because what hotel doesn't need a bar? We actually had so much fun doing all of this, just hanging out, chilling. Um, we ended up becoming a proper tight knit group, not a cult, not a cult. A group just a group of friends in fact I'm pretty sure we're going by the Golden Apple Society at this point uh, like I said not a cult you don't have to worry about that and as you can see wind finally died in the end oops but at this point I think he's at like nearly 400 deaths or so and we started expanding the base more and more each time um right here i'm actually building a shrine it's not a shrine uh, we're not a cult i guess you could actually call it a shrine for the golden apple because the gapple is giver of life and praise to all the golden apple we're not a cult there was some jokes about a cult being made because there was a cult in the first season but this is season two this is totally different we are not a cult as a whole though it's a pretty good build. For the blocks we had in the end, we actually did all right. And now with the return of Gasp with everybody's elytras, it was time to head back to the overworld. See you there. So we're back from the end and we haven't got a lot of durability on our elytra. So we are going the old fashioned way. Um, yeah, we've got a marker ahead of us over that way. We saw something wrong with our, um, our zombie spawner and a little bit of a flaw. So I'm gonna go and grab some ice to help push the zombies along. A few moments later. So apparently you need silk touch, which I do not have. Luckily, Dolphin is kind enough. Right, uh, back to home we go. So that's really good. We've just got to figure out a place where we can meet up with Dolphin. It was a bit of a waste of a journey, but we went out on our horse, which was a nice little ride. Oh no. Oh no. I knew that was going to happen. The terrain around here is deadly. I'm so sorry. Um, I can go to Blossom's place, which isn't all that far. Yeah, I can get there. And so we head off to meet Dolphin, and apparently when you say the word society in something, it means you're, you've started a cult. It's okay. We're part of the Golden Apple Society. Golden Apple? Are you guys starting a cult? It's not a cult. That's what we said about Stee. <laughs> <laughs> After having a little chuckle about the uh, ongoings of the Stee group of season one, we carried on our way and we eventually found what we thought was Blossom's Mountain. I am very good at getting lost and I think I overshot what was not actually Blossom's Mountain and ended up on a totally different one. So I decided I was going to part from my horse and have a good old look. Even took a look around in Freecam and yeah. The marker was right there, I didn't even see it for some reason. I was just looking for a gaping hole in the side of the mountain, but none of them were Blossom's base. Of course it wasn't, because it wasn't actually the right mountain. 
but once I realised, <coughs> we got back, Dolphin was here, and they gave me a little more than that single block that I needed. 1.7k to be exact. And that was that, transaction done, didn't have to pay or anything, and Dolphin was off. And so were we, me and my trusty horse were on our way back with no distractions until that ruined portal. No, you mother. Of course, that's exactly how I roll. I swear I'm going to be absolutely miffed if this despawns. I can't believe that happened. My horse is up here around here something. There, there, there he is. Oh! Please still be there, please still be there. Oh. Yes. Not that. Oh my gosh. That was a distraction I did not need. Right, now that that's as fixed as it can be, we need to gather a bunch of resources. In order to do so, we need some uh, new tools. So we're going to grab some iron tools and we're going to grab a bunch of uh yeah this kind of stuff see in a sec They can roam free however they like. In the next episode we will actually set up their stations and get some trades going because we need some backup uh, armour tools and whatnot. Thank you for watching. If you have liked what you've seen so far please do consider leaving a like, subscribe if you haven't already and we will see you in the next one. So without further ado, goodbye. Thank you.